The operator is responsible for the safe operation of the excavator and the safety of all others working around the machine by ensuring that the work area is safe. Conducting a worksite hazard assessment and continually being aware of your surroundings is one of the most important things you will do. Inspect the worksite for hazards prior to each shift or when the site or conditions change. If hazards are found during the assessment, it is the operator's responsibility to eliminate the hazard or ensure the hazard has been reported and can be easily identified and avoided while working. Walk around the work site to see what conditions may be encountered during the course of your work shift. Always locate and identify buried utilities before digging. In the United States, use the national one call number 811. Serious injuries and damage could occur if underground utilities are contacted or broken. Search for overhead electrical lines. Never operate the excavator in an area where overhead power lines exist without ensuring the lines are de-energized. Examine the site for culverts or drains that may not support the weight of the grade off. Open trenches must be protected or barricaded from workers and pedestrians and shoring must be used when workers enter trenches. Consult OSHA for additional regulations regarding trenches. Avoid excessively steep slopes or unstable surfaces. If you must drive on a slope, keep the boom low, pointing downhill, and proceed slowly with extreme caution. Avoid driving across excessively steep slopes under any circumstance and undercutting the rear tires. Ensure personnel and obstructions are not within the circle of safety around the machine. The circle of safety represents the area around the machine that is within the swing radius of the boom. It is the operator's responsibility to stop operating the excavator if personnel enter the circle of safety. When the excavator needs to be positioned on a roadway or near walkways, the operator must ensure that there are adequate traffic control devices, such as flagmen, barriers, warning lights, cones, signs, or other warning devices in place. Things to remember. Conduct a worksite hazard assessment. Call before you dig, 811. De-energize overhead power lines. Establish the circle of safety.